All right, we are back again with Mr. Emmanuel and Ms. Sanaa doing a peer activity, peer-led activity, and that is body part identification. Do you know your body parts? Oh, I, uh, oh, I get it. I know that the body parts too, so I'm ready. All right, he is ready. We're gonna do our body parts. And Sanaa, if you can just lead him through this, and we'll kind of work together, okay? So I want you to make sure you're listening to Miss Sanaa. She is your help, your instructor. She's gonna help you, and you guys, are, we're gonna do it together, okay? Aye, aye, Captain. All right, so let's look at Miss Sanaa. Miss Sanaa, oh, go right. ahead. Do you know what time is your left hand? Oh yeah, left arm. Good job, make sure you're showing it, yep. I got Good, so we did the left arm, good. Right arm. Good. Your knee. How many knees do you have? Two knees. Nice. Your waist. Waist. Good job, what can you do with your waist? Body. You can, how about we move it like this? There we go. You can do it too, come on Sana. there we go. And then let's move it the other way. All right, so we're just moving our bodies and exercising, but identifying our body parts, which is key. Yep. Ooh, and you got some good hair on that head. I'm a little jealous. All right, good. Good job. We'll go like that. Good. And look. Emmanuel, good job. And if you went, you were going backwards, right, Sana? So if we can do. But, 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 but how would you get it backwards and the, the arm circle just like that one? No, you did it great. You did it great. But listen to what Sana just said. Forward. Can you go the other way with your arms? Do it, you can do it super duper. That's backwards and then go forwards. Let me help you. Like that, try it that way. All right, so the, when, when we change things up, Sana, just so if you're ever working with other people, we wanna make sure that if you do something on the right arm, you try it on the left. If you do something forward, maybe we try it backwards because that works both hemispheres of the brain or our body completely. Hey, that was good. Hey, way to lead, way to lead, okay? Good job. We're gonna try our next group of activities here in a second, okay? Let me hear your hands. Good. Coach Dave here, wrapping up the body part identification activity with Emmanuel. And there's two key points that we wanna emphasize here. Is one, that this is a fundamental skill that you can be teaching to your students, clients, adults that you're working with. Um, two, this activity provides the opportunity for differentiation um, for whoever you're working with. Some students or clients may just point and identify to the body parts. Some may actually build exercises or a program around specific body parts. So try this activity to help your students, your clients, or children make the exercise connection.